Are you considering selling your home on your own to save on that hefty commission fee? Hi, I'm your host, and today I'm delving into the real world of selling your home by yourself. Is it a money saver or just a major headache? Let's get into it. Selling your home, a place filled with memories and milestones, is never easy. But when you decide to go the for sale by owner route, or FSBO as it's commonly known, you're signing up for more than just putting up a for sale sign. You're stepping into a world that's usually navigated by professionals. Now, on paper, the idea sounds financially appealing. Consider this. A standard 6% commission on a $500,000 home amounts to $30,000. That's right, $30,000 that could stay in your pocket. That kind of money is hard to ignore, and it could be worth the extra effort over a couple of months. But let's talk about what that effort involves. First off, you'll encounter a slew of potential buyers, and not all of them will be ready, willing, or even able to pull the trigger on purchasing your home. Filtering out the serious buyers from the looky-loos can be more than a little frustrating. Then, there are the endless phone calls. Some from genuinely interested parties, but many from real estate agents looking to convince you to list with them, or from investors and wholesalers looking for a bargain. These calls can happen at all hours of the day, disrupting your daily life. And if you think you've crossed all hurdles once you find a serious buyer, think again. The home inspection can open up a whole new can of worms. Issues you weren't even aware of might come to light, and dealing with these can be tricky without professional help. Yes, the road to selling your home by yourself isn't smooth. It's paved with challenges that can test your patience and resolve. But remember the big picture here. That $30,000 saving on commission can contribute significantly towards your future plans, maybe towards buying your next home or even funding a dream project. The journey of FSBO isn't for everyone. It demands time, patience, and a thick skin. But for those who stick it out, the financial rewards can be substantial. It's about weighing the headaches against the savings and deciding what matters most to you. So if you're up for the challenge, equipped with the right information, and ready to learn on the fly, selling your home yourself could not just be a financial win, but a great personal achievement. It's not just about saving money, it's about taking control. And who doesn't like having control over their own destiny? That's it for today's topic. If you're planning to sell your home, weigh your options carefully and choose the path that best suits your circumstances. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more insights right here. See you next time.